hi guys welcome back to my channel and i just cannot believe what is going on in bath and body works um online crashed they are no longer having any candles online and then when you get to the stores they are completely sold out of candles you guys okay so without any further ado let's talk about all this Okay, so I'm going to back up a little bit because you guys flooded my DMs. Well, not like flooded, flooded, but enough of you guys were um, leaving me messages, <clears throat> excuse me, letting me know that you were online trying to order your candles, but the site kept crashing. Even my daughter, Sydney, you know, she was telling me, she's like, mommy, the site is crashing. I can't order my candles like, oh, you know. And then um, some other, a, a lot of you guys, you know, that are probably watching now, let me know that you um, weren't sure if your order even went through in the first place. Now, I didn't get online, you guys. Um, I wasn't interested in online shopping um, simply because I didn't want to run into those problems. I... I didn't think that the site was necessarily going to crash. I just thought that they'd be sold out, you know, um, so quickly that I wouldn't have time to really think about it and select my candles and, you know, things like that. And then I was worried about the shipping taking so long because lately shipping, you know, to my house has been like a week two weeks, 14 days just to get, you know, a package. And I, my state isn't that far from, well, I guess I wouldn't know where the distribution centers, but, you know, they are mainly based in Ohio. And I was thinking where I'm at is, I mean, it's, it's not a walk up the street, but it's not like that far where it would take two weeks. You know, usually when I place an order, international order, let's say from China um, or, you know, um, any region like that, it takes a while. I've waited sometimes in upwards of a month to get a package. So, you know, I didn't want to have to deal with any of that, but I didn't think that the site um, was going to necessarily crash and it was just crashing left and right. And <clears throat> it was just so frustrating because you guys were leaving your comments, um, well, your DMs, I should say, and you were just like, Nicole, the site is crashing. You know, I want it to be safer by staying home and ordering online, but I can't even get my candles because the site is crashing and it's as if Bath and Body Works wants us to go into the actual store and everything. So I, a lot of you guys did not want to go physically into the store for good reasons, you know. Um, so yeah, because we know, I won't say that word but we know what's going on um and so for good reason i can understand you guys not wanting to go you know oh and i do have on clothes you guys um, i have an off the shoulder here i guess i could have put the maybe i'll adjust the, the cam the camera where you can actually see that i have anyhow so um yeah online was a complete hot total mess from what I am hearing. You guys, like I said, I was not physically on um, the website. I was, you know, down at the stores. And so let me tell you guys my experience. Um, we arrived not as early as I wanted to. My store, I believe, opened at 6 a.m. They had everything set up from the video. Um, I did a shop with me video, you guys, plus um, another, I did a shop with me video. So you, I will link that video if you guys want to check it out and you can see um, there was no one, there was no line formed. There was no one in front of me. I was able to, the SA had the bags lined up with the crates already inside, passing them out to people. So I was able to just, you know, grab the bag and walk right in. I even was able to leisurely film um, the entire thing. So yeah, um, and the essays were so wonderful and so nice. Um, so that was my experience. Um, I do wish I had gotten there a little earlier um, just to get it out of the way and everything. But, you know, my experience overall went you know, really well. I didn't have to deal with waiting in long, long lines. Um, and there weren't enough people in the store to where they had to start forming the line and only allowing, let's say, you know, 20 or some odd people in at the time, 
you know, at a time to shop. They had the signs ready to do that, but in this particular area, um, it wasn't flooded with people yet. So yeah, and some of you guys com commented that, wow, your store was not even that crowded and ooh, you know, and everything. So yes, um, it, whew, you, <laughs> you guys, so yeah, um, I'm just, I was just so, I felt so badly for you guys because you couldn't get your online candles. And then um, by day two, which was Saturday, um, my daughter decided that she wanted to go and get some candles. And so we went to where she lived in Arkansas to take a look around. And we went to a fabulous outdoor mall. I, I love that mall out there. Um, and we drove up and the line was formed all the way down the outdoor mall. So the line was formed all the way down the street. And my daughter was like, nope, I don't think so. Now, see, for me, I was just excited. I was thinking it's day two, you know, hey, I'm, I'd be willing to stand in, in the long line, you know, and get some candles because people were, I mean, in that line, they were dedicated. Now, I will say this, it was sort of later in the afternoon, though. I'm telling you guys, when, when things like this take place, you have to be literally like the first person standing there. You have to set your alarms, wake up early and get there early, you know. But so anyhow, and my daughter said, mommy, I am not standing in that line. So, you know, I was with them. So I had to, you know, go ahead and drive off with them. But then I personally, um, like it, if I had driven myself, then I would have stayed in the line um, and just, you know, suffered through it and then got my candles um, because this is just a really good deal. This is a really good sale. Perfect time to stock up and get those candles. Um, and then we drove to a second location location and that's where they had the sign up and they were like we're sorry we are out of candles we have some other things but we don't have any candles so you know and I took a picture of that sign and that's what you see on the thumbnail you guys this was the second location that we had tried um to get candles so yes um you know, now this is day three and that's why I'm getting this video out to you guys to let you know that some of the stores have already closed and they're closed online. So yeah. And then, yes, I'm going to be doing a, I don't know if I'm going to be doing a second haul, but I'm going to be doing a candle wrap up video. I'm going to be giving you guys, um, some more information about what was going on in the stores and everything so be sure you subscribe to my channel so you can see that video you can press your notification bell if you want to be notified the moment I upload that video um, and if I do do a second haul and then if I do have a second haul I will obviously share that with you guys as well okay you guys so this is day three I hope you can find your candles meet me back here okay for that candle day wrap up and yeah I'll see you guys then. Bye for now, Starfires.